The COVID-19 pandemic has taken a heavy toll on the world economy. In June, the IMF revised down its global growth forecast this year to minus 4.9% from 3.3% in January. The picture for individual economies is overwhelmingly gloomy. One of the few bright spots is China's economy, projected to grow by 1% this year and 8.2% in 2021. China is implementing tailored measures to balance epidemic control and economic recovery. Major indexes gradually go up as business activities continue to expand. The Purchasing Managers Index, or PMI, for China's manufacturing sector ticked up to 50.9 in June from 50.6 in May. The Business Climate Index stood at 42.7% for the April to June period, 12.4 percentage points higher than the first quarter. From January to May, China's FDI totaled over 355 billion yuan, with the overall decline narrowing to 3.8%. China has also approved the plan to build Hainan into a freight trade port, as favorable policies continue to unveil. The island lowers income tax rate to 15% for eligible companies. Tax-free shopping quota is lifted to 100,000 yuan, or about 14,142 US dollars per person each year. China has granted export tax rebates worth 632.4 billion yuan, or about 89.4 billion US dollars, in the first five months. 200 million yuan, or about 28.3 million US dollars, will be put into use to improve the China Europe rail freight services. The IMF says China's growth will contribute to the overall recovery of emerging markets and developing economies in 2021. The organization urges stronger multilateral cooperation at a time of uncertainties and slow recovery.